Are you tired of reels taking so long to create? In this video, I am going to share with you my three tools that I use to make 30 reels, you heard it, 30 reels in three hours or less. My name is Michelle Gifford, I'm a brand and marketing strategist. I'm here to help you grow online, so let's do it. The first tool is called CapCut. Now you've probably heard of CapCut if you've ever been over on TikTok because CapCut is a way to create and edit videos. But the cool thing about CapCut is they also have these video templates. And from TikTok, if you saw them, you could see a trending template that people are using. There's actually a direct link on that video that you can click and it takes it directly over to CapCut where you can create that video really quickly and then post it back to TikTok. It's really smooth, really cool. But how do you use that for Instagram since that feature is not quite here yet? Let me show you how to do it. Now, one of the most important parts of creating really good reels is having good hooks. And so I created 131 hooks that sell guide. It's a free guide. And if you want that, you can click the link below or you can text hooks to 951-309-7885 and I will send it right to you. So the first thing you're going to do, you're gonna open the app and you're gonna see on the app people who create templates. These are templates that you probably will use and then reels, so for Instagram and then for TikTok. There's a bunch of different categories that you can use to find these templates. Let's choose this one and what you're gonna do. I mean, I'm, I'm so passionate about it and it's what I do You're passionate. all the time. Yeah. So I'm just gonna click and use the template and then I'm just going to choose one of my most recent clips. We'll do this exercise one and hit preview. So now you see that it's your video with, is that Kim? <laughs> A Kardashian's face over it saying the words and then you can click text and then you can actually click and edit the text so it fits your video. It's as easy as that. So the way we're going to create 30 reels is we're going to create six different types of reels and create five of each. I recommend that you go to Cap cut and you find five trending audios and just create five videos from a video that you've already created. Now let me give you a pro tip here, okay? Because it's not as easy to jump on a trend on Instagram with these as it is on TikTok. Because again, on TikTok, you can find a video that has a CapCut template on it. You can click it, go to CapCut, and then post it back to it. And it connects your video to that audio. And that's actually where the real big power happens is when you jump on a trending audio and it gets traction, but not quite as easy over on Instagram. So what I like to do is if I see any of these things that are trending, I will save the reel to one of my folders and then I'll go back to CapCut, try to find that same template that I saw on Instagram, record the video in CapCut, download it, and then go back over to Instagram, go to that reel audio, and then upload my video. So then my video is connected to the trending audio. I know it's a little couple extra steps, but right now that is the best way to do it. So my recommendation is to do this. Try this out because this is a really fun and easy way to create five reels fast. Okay, so we have five, right? We have five reels. The next thing we're going to do is we're going to go to Canva. Now I'm actually going to go through these pretty quickly because I did a whole video all about this that walks you through how I made 20 reels in Canva, but we'll just touch on them really briefly. So let's go to the computer. So the first one in Canva, we're going to make five of these and they are tweet reels. And this is where we find some interesting things that we've said or that an industry leader has said, even some tips or a story, and we put it in tweet form and we're going to put it over this stock video. The next one we're going to create are quote ones. So we're going to come up with five five quotes that have to do with our niche market. And we're gonna make five of these. Now, again, I have a video that walks you through the step-by-step -step of how to do this, but I'm gonna just run through these really quickly. The third one is where we make a carousel of images into a video. So if I were a photographer, which I am, then I could create a carousel of all of these pictures and it's just gonna pop through them really quickly so it shows my audience it's a real, I would put this against trending audio and bada boom, bada bing, you've got it. All right, I'm gonna make five of those. The next ones we're gonna create are tip reels. We're gonna come up with a way that we can serve our audience and share some tips and we're going to just use some of our own personal B-roll or stock images and we're going to lay tips over them. So we'll see how this one works. So you'll notice that the sound wasn't there for a trending audio. That's because I create over here and then I come over to Instagram and then I'll upload this with some trending audio. Let's pause right there and we're going to take a tally of how many reels we have created so far. So first we have five in CapCut. We have five Twitter ones. We have five quote ones. We have five carousel ones. And then we have five tip ones. So five times five is 25. So just five more. And the next tool is actually dun dun dun, Instagram itself because Instagram is making it easier and easier for you to create reels 
cycles really fast. So when I'm on Instagram, just as I'm scrolling throughout the week, I am going to pay attention to the reels that are being fed to me because Instagram algorithm is feeding me reels that they think I will like. As I scroll through them, I'm going to hit and save. And when I save, I have the option to put that saved into a separate folder. So let's do a separate folder. Let's do new reels. And I can also invite someone there with me. As I'm using Instagram, I am going to create this folder of either audios that I like, or maybe there's some topic that I want to talk about and I'm going to put it in that folder. And then when I'm ready to create, I will go to my saved content. I will go into my reels that I've saved and I will scroll through and I will just choose five to either use the trending audio for or use the teaching concept and create some teaching reels. So I'm going to make five of those. All right. If we did the math right, then we had 25 and then we just added five more. That's 30. And if you'd set aside a few hours every month and did this, then you would have 30 reels and you could post one every day and you really see your business grow. Thanks so much for joining me. Make sure you're subscribed and we'll see you next time.